Hey guys, welcome back to my video today. I wanted to show you my IBM 6169. I mean, uh, 5153. I think, yeah. Start for that. You got the Reflection Supreme. Um, this is an awesome honor. I've always wanted one of these, and I finally have one. Uh, I don't think it's straight on my computer. It's kind of goes in A's. I don't feel like moving it though, because it's so freaking big. It's really heavy. Before I had like a, a monitor with this one like this. Oh my goodness, it's his great great grandpaps. It's his great great grandpaps. <laughs> and a thick card in it. Um So yeah, and this just talk about it. I uh, can't really test it right now because the adapter is this is CGA and this is VGA, so I need a converter. This like has the first VGA ever on the marketplace so yeah so i need that because you know because my way it worked <laughs> awesome so, like i'm really glad i finally have one now it's so gorgeous it smells beautiful it smells like an old 1890s house um as you can see it needs a little bit of a cleaning just see you know, just has dirt and stuff on it which is kind of, which is completely normal for how old this is. It was 1986. It's like 30, 40 years old. I'm like, I get, this is like really easily clean. Just get some Clorox wipes, just rub that. Maybe some rubbing alcohol to get the bigger bumps and scuff marks right there. I haven't even cleaned it yet. I just turned it on. Then yeah, there's a little crack right here, which is completely normal again. Once again, like that's completely normal. Like he has, he also has cracks as you can see. That's just normal for older computers when they've been shipped all the way from Kansas to Ohio. That's gonna happen. And this is pretty brittle plastic too, so you gotta be careful with that. It's glass. Oh, it isn't all CT's glass. Um, yeah, uh, maybe you can see the bag of it. Mm, you can read that, I think, and then there's the IBM 5153 sticker. Uh, can't really show that. Oh, here's the color. Mm, gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm gonna try to show you guys the IBM 5153 logo. There it is. I think you guys saw that. It's, it's in a really weird area. I was thinking of moving it right there, but I kind of like him being down here in his cozies. Let me get his Fandy Cotton 4K. So, yeah. And there's like another little crack right there. I don't know what kind of crack for that. Oh, I need to smell. I need to smell. Oh, man. That smells like IBM. I don't know why, but that just looks like that just smells like IBM. Okay, so now let's get to the part where we can test it. I think I've showed you everything. <sighs> Out of this thick one, it always turns on for some reason. Stop! Stop! Yeah. Someone's like, what the freak was? What is this? I didn't even see that mark. Man, there's like a, some deep on here. So yeah, I'm going to test it, and it does something weird. I don't know if that means it's broken or it's just, you know, get it adjust, but I'll show you that when I do. That is so beautiful. Oh, uh, uh, okay, the jitteriness. Oh, IB, I mean, what is that called? Epilepsy warning. The guys have to slap that video out of existence. <laughs> Thank you, this. So the jitteriness, as you can maybe see, it's moving around. That's normal. Just, you know, gotta... <clears throat> There's... Get a close-up on that. There's, uh, like, V and Y horizontal thing over there. You just gotta mess around with that. But this, this. I don't know if this is something easy, like a capacitor. Or the tube's fractured. No, the tube is fractured when it worked. So it's not a tube, problem. It's probably a capacitor problem. As you can see, it's like a board right here. And the colors are like supreme. If you guys know how to fix that or you know what's wrong with it, please let me know because I want to know. But yeah, here it is running. Can't test it because you know, VGA boy. Not EGA. 
That's so cool. I was like, these are colors over here. Look, see, look, what is that? What, what, what the, what the, what the, hey, hey, what's, what's that magnet? It looks like a magnet. Like, someone just put a magnet up to this. So, if you guys let me know if it's just something really simple, just, you know, some problem with the adjustment or something. Or, yeah, just please let me know what it is. But yeah, here it is running. That's so gorgeous. I, to me, it doesn't look like a problem if I just flip it on. Maybe some colors would be mixed with, like, blue, black. It's probably be pink, whatever. Yeah. It is jittering around a little bit because the VNY sync are messed up. Just gotta fix that. So, yeah. That's it running, and here's the shutdown.